back, look. The wall's closing in. the Marines out. Good. They've already interfered too much in my plans. You stupid fool! The Marines are still alive! You weak like that! Notify me promptly at Halfway Island. Nice look, an opening. No, you don't. Open that door. I can't. It's locked from the outside. Tiger Shark went through there, didn't he? How do you open that passageway? I don't know. There he goes. Headed for Halfway Island. going along with you. Thanks for opening the door, Professor. We'll get a plane at the base and fly to Halfway Island. Leave the natives here. You come with me. The Marines have practically wiped out my entire organization. What are we going to do? We've got to get off the island and look for a new hideout. The Marines! I'll make them wish they never followed me to the island. Shall I call the natives? No. We'll bring them down with a radio gravity gun. Well, 
Landed kind of hard, didn't you, pal? <laughs> I bounced around a little. Take some of that treasure along with us. We'll have to blow the door open. Bring the night of glycerin. And careful how you handle it. Why, we can live like kings with all of this. You'd better be getting some of it out to the plains. Grab that bag of gold. Caves just beyond that rise. Yeah, we'd better take it easy. Come on. Thank you. 
So the Colonel's mess boy turns out to be the tiger shark. We've got enough treasure. Let's get to the plane. Take you back to the mainland and have you tell them who the tiger shark is? That's the end of the tiger shark. For gallant and courageous service above and beyond the call of duty, it's my pleasure to award each of you in the name of a grateful government, the Navy Cross.